we use the self rescue technique those low wind days that suddenly the wind drops and our kite falls into the water and cannot be relaunched to go back to the beach. In this case we use this technique to return to the beach with all our equipment no matter how far you are if there's some onshore or side onshore wind. The first step is to pull the quick release of the chicken loop and fix it to avoid the kite gets power again. To do it, it doesn't matter where the kite is. First, release the bar and after, activate the quick release of the chicken loop. At this time, we pull the leash and the line with your hands and finger from the top, being careful not to entangle ourselves with it. Now, we should not take the chicken loop until we have fixed the security line because otherwise the kite would pull the line returning to give power to the kite. We pull up the line until the end and fix to the bar with two knobs of this type. This way the kite will not take power. The second step is to attach the leash to the board as quickly as possible. To do this, we take the line strongly, disconnect the leash, pass it through the handle or a foot strap of the board and reconnect it to the line. Thus, we can release the board without losing it. Now, the goal is to reach the kite, but we should not do it pulling from the line without picking it up because we would have four lines of 20 meters floating around us so we could entangle ourselves with them and would be dangerous. For this reason we will tangle the lines on the bar in the most convenient way. We recommend using the bar as a lever to avoid having to do a lot of strength. When we are 3 meters away from the kite, fix the lines to the bar to be able to release the bar having the lines under control. To do this, do the same knot we did before with the power line. At this point, we release the bar and pull from a line to arrive to the kite and turn it. However, turning the kite around in the water will be quite difficult. So we will use the wind to help us turning around the kite. To do it, Put a hand behind the strut to pry, catch the end of the kite with the other hand and bend the leading edge bringing it to the other hand. This way the wind will turn around the kite. Then we will be placed so that pulling one of the lines we are able to bring the other side of the kite, closing it and using it as a windsurf sail to drag us down to the beach with all our equipment. In summary, 1. Release the bar, pull the quick release of the chicken loop and fix the line to the bar to avoid that the kite takes power again. 2. Hook the board with the leash to avoid losing it. 3. Pick up and tangle lines to the bar to avoid entangle ourselves with them. 4. Take the kite and turn it. 5. Stand in self-rescue position and return to the beach. Your soul's not